And in my sophomore year, I started studying Spanish. I had no Spanish. And so I had two years of Spanish uh, in uh, the sophomore and junior year. I had Portuguese in my senior year. And I took all three one semester courses that Harvard had to offer in Latin America, the Jewish angle. In my junior year, after I had taken, I guess by that time, I, in two years, I had taken them all, uh, my junior year, uh, I began thinking about my senior thesis. Because at Harvard, you could graduate cum laude with just on grades. But if you wanted anything beyond that, you had to do a, a, a thesis. And so what did I think about? With pogroms being in the air in Europe, the auto de fe, the grand auto de fe in Peru in the late 1630s. I had read about the Inquisition, and uh, I thought, well, this would be an interesting subject. I was given a stall in the basement of Widener Library at, at the conjunction when the Latin American collection ended and Judaica began. Now, as I was working on this subject and reading everything I could lay my hands on, including, by the way, a book in Yiddish by an, an Argentine uh, historian on the Jewish communities, and, and this was going to be one of my sources, ultimately I couldn't find enough to justify dissertation, but I spent the summer of my junior year, junior to senior year, uh, reading whatever I could, travel documents, whatnot. And uh, one gets tired of sitting on a hard wooden chair. And so I would get up and go through the stacks. And, you know, go right next, you know, pull out a book, no, you know, just as a diversion. And I can remember going to uh, a stack, seeing a big book like, well, let's see what that is. I open it. I said, what, what language is this? It, it, was it Hebrew? I said, if it is, I don't understand it. Is it Yiddish? I sounded out the letters. And it was, I am Lamed, Aleph, Mem, Yud, Gimel, Aleph, Dalid, Lamed, Aleph, Fe, Aleph, Mem, Yud, Lamed, Yud, Aleph. And as I read it from right to left, I said, my God, el amigo de la familia. It's Spanish. Because it wasn't Spanish, it was Ladino. And that was my first exposure to Ladino.